Planet Jolva, Lodestone Cluster. Information Broker 1115, Local Group Node. So, it seems you are quite fortunate. We found the source of the signal you were so interested in. An obscure world known locally as Tolva. The planet is riddled with emanations and electromagnetic footprints. Some ancient, others more recent. You will need to examine the surface close up eliminate the false positives, and manually identify the precise origin of this signal. We took the liberty of hijacking a surveyor for you to control remotely. If this chassis is destroyed, we can connect you to another. Our clearance is low level, for now. Surveyor directed missions should lead us to the signal and boost our clearance. Oh, and do be careful. A zealot frigate crashed on the surface of the planet. They aren't happy about it. We are patching you into the control network. You will soon be exploring the surface of Tolva. Establishing connection to remote surveyor host. And connection, there we go! Connection established. Tolva. Hey folks, welcome back to After Work Gaming. We are back with a brand new game called The Signal from Tolva. It came out April 10th, uh, which was uh, smack dab in the middle of my hiatus, for which I apologize again. A uh, little bit of an explanation in the comments. And yeah, I know nothing about this game, which shouldn't surprise anybody other than it has robots and we're in space. So... I do have hints on, sort of, I mean, we can press F1, see it says up in the corner, uh, but who the heck needs that, right? Let's see, what can we do? We got weapon, uh, better weapon, yet another weapon. We are a robot, right? So that's why our arms are spindly. <laughs> cool. What can I do without a weapon? I can zoom. Can I do anything without it? No. Can I jump? I can jump. Can I crouch? I can crouch. Uh, flashlight? Nope. Yeah, I'm hearing myself clanking around. That's cool. Can I run? I can totally run. Let's see, let's see. Let's just run back and forth here a little bit. Anything we should be looking at? I don't know if this game is... I think there's, like, some shooting aspects to it. Obviously, we have guns. But I don't know if this is, like, a puzzle game, if this is an exploration game, or what. Um, I don't even know what this is. <laughs> <laughs> but it's cool. I'm all about the way this game presents stuff. Okay. Is there anything, anything, anything? Select target for data capture. No data available. Oh, I guess we can, like, hold on. Nope, nothing. Okay. Can we... Ooh, it's a ship. Network shuttle! K-59 Surveyor Origin. Cool. Very neat. Okay. Hey, buddy. What are you? Unmarked drone. Incoming transmission. There's a surveyor ahead. You're controlling a similar chassis, so surveyor will remain neutral towards you. Please don't attack them. All right, all right. Jeez. Easy. Easy bones. Oh, I guess that's it. Scanning complete. No, nothing. Okay, fine. Uh, is there something in these boxes, maybe? Network uh, Calculode Tingle category. Network Engine Lump category. Interesting. Is there anything around here? Usually in these kind of games, there's weird, like, nook and cranny stuff. You know what I really like, by the way? Uh, this isn't... I mean, obviously, you can see us walking around, and if you guys are having problems, I know some people get uh, motion sick from that. Just let me know. What I really like, though, is 
this isn't just walking around. This is like lurching forward like a like a drone would, right? On like, I mean, you saw that thing walking around. I'm assuming that's what we are. So on like these like spindly legs, we're just kind of like falling forward essentially. <laughs> Okay, Gemini Scar, I guess maybe that's where we are. Okay, let's... No, it's just little bunny hops. Okay, what's this? Surveyor OP Marker Beacon Variant, online. Yeah, see? What up, buddy? Hello. No, nothing? Yeah, lump category. Okay, we already did that. Thanks. Uh, let's see. Z to engage your flashlight. Oh. There's more to disengage. Oh, I see. Okay. So we got three settings. This is our... This is the marker. Sure, why not? Okay, we have to go over there. We're going to do that in a second. I just want to walk around here. What's this? No data available. This is like ancient ruins, I guess, right? Cool. Okay. Let's pass through here and see what else we got. Okay, obviously we're heading towards that, but I don't want to head... Gemini Scar, waypoint reached. Navigation guidance. You have reached the first waypoint. Place your waypoints by using the map screen, M. The map screen displays the location of important sites across the world. Capture bunkers to access their facilities and increase surveyor patrols. You may acquire a new robot at a friendly bunker or beacon at any time. You will be forced to do this if your current chassis is destroyed. You can also activate system beacons to extend your map control. The proximity sensor right here on your HUD also indicates nearby signals and resources. Go to my map. Uh, ready to do? Press right mouse button here to set your waypoint. Set. Oh, cool. Also, this map is huge. <laughs> cool. Okay, press tab to view the data library. Right mouse button to set a waypoint. Tab. Signal data, connection data node. Uh, connection data note. We have connected you to a surveyor subnetwork on your planet's surface. If you cause a robot to be destroyed, you will connect to another. Surveyors will not act against you in a hostile capacity, so do not antagonize them. Other factions are also present and at work on the surface. Broker's notes. The source of the signal could be anything. I believe it may be a zealot trap. We will help you as far as is possible from our remote location, but this is up to you. Very cool. I don't know what that battery thing means. I guess this is money, and I don't know what those are. Cool. Uh, let's just go map again. Gemini Scar, location. Press F to hijack a drone at this location. We're not going to do that now. Um, awesome. No? Oh, hold on. Hold on. Camper class EM emitter surveyor origin. Cool. Look at that thing. I wonder if that's the thing that crash landed. Remember, there's like a zealot frigate or something that supposedly crashed? Okay. Alright, but I'm not, I mean, like, other than finding the source of the signal, whatever that may mean, I'm wondering what else there is to be done. Not that I'm not enjoying myself. I mean, then walking around is pretty cool, and here we go. I'm assuming this is what's going to open up our world now. <laughs> It's gonna rock our worldview or something. I also like the art style. Press F to gather these material samples and use them for equipment requisition. Unknown machine, no origin determined. Yeah, 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 okay. Um, sure. Oh, I see. The money. The money. 30. Take that. Sure. Hello. No data available. Fine. Sure, why not? Woo! 155. That is one pricey piece of scrap. You know what this looks like? Look at that. They look like vertebrae. That's cool. In various different reasoned ways. So I'm wondering, like... I mean, this can't be like, uh, what is it? It's not Horizon Zero Dawn. What's that game that, um... 
It's on, like, PlayStation or whatever, where you have to hunt giant machines, whose name I can't remember. Surveyor Illuminator Prong. Cool. I'm wondering if there are, like, robotic animals around here. Probably not. I'm probably completely out of my mind, but I'm curious about this world. No, these are organic animals. Here we go. No? Nothing? Okay, fine. What's this? I'm seeing... Is this more scrap, you think? This looks like a drone. Unmarked drone. Bandit chassis. Damaged. Easy, 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 easy. Hmm. Okay, I'm seeing a question mark over there. I'm seeing some sort of... Derelict star network structure. Reading corrupted. It's over here, I see. Uh, let's go... Hmm. Okay, so that's that. Let's... Let's go check out over here first. Because, right... Because the rocks sort of, like, hook around, and they go this way, and then we're going to go that way anyway. So let's just go ahead and check out what's over here. Because this looks pretty interesting. Oh, oh, oh. Here we go. Thank you, Scrap. I mean, obviously, walking around looking for scrap is pretty fun, pretty fun and interesting in and of itself because it, it forces you to walk around the environment. But something tells me there's got to be more. No data available. It's a tree, man. It's a tree. Let me write the data descriptions, huh? Description: Tree. Whoa. Hello. Anything here? Nope. Okay. Cool. Um, not that I'm eager to go shooting my gun at people, and why are you following me, little guy? I'm not keen on you following me around. Not keen on you at all. <laughs> really? Sorry, I can't get over the fact that I really enjoy the lurching, like, gait that this thing has. It give, really does give the illusion that you're... New zone discovered. Q-mass basin. Waypoint reached. Incoming transmission. Your drone chassis can see in multiple spectra. Try activating your scan vision. Whoa. What? Activate your scanner and look for emissions. Really? I wonder what that does. Press G to examine the area for signals. Yeah, 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 yeah. We'll do that in a second. Right? Is there... Hmm. Hold on a second. Give me... One moment. Oh, so it opened up a brand new area. Interesting. Do, 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 do. Okay. Hmm. Okay, let's go check out this G. Incoming transmission. That's good. We can calibrate your sensor on the artifact. Whoa! <laughs> That's what they mean by emissions. Oh, also, there's that thing that we can pick up. Okay. No data available. Yeah, I bet. F. Scanning. Cool. Survey one of one. Initial calibration scan complete. Incoming. That's good. We've been able to calibrate your sensor against that artifact. Now find a bunker. Military bunker. Yeah, let's set that as my spawn beacon. Uh, under surveyor control. Surveyor control. That's, so that's us, right? Okay. Let's see. What else do we have? I guess we don't really see the emissions until we get super close, though. Which is fine. There we go. What the heck? E. Weird. Okay. Okay, so that gave us scrap. What is this? Anyway. Derelict Star Network Structure Reading Corrupted. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Let's follow the lights, then. Pretty cool. Alright, so some more stuff to do than simply walking around collecting scrap. Fine by me. 
No data available. Fine. I don't need your data anyway. Let's go to the bunker. Let's go. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go to the bunker. We're gonna see where we are in terms of. Uh... Shh. I heard birds whistling. Hello. Check out these like symbols. Okay, I'll take that. I'll take that too. No data. No data. Just another derelict structure. Fine. Hello. I wonder what the concept is. So I'm curious to know what the consequence of scanning something is. Add it to library, archive remnant ZZ. Data snoopers like these will collect and retain various kinds of transmitted data. We should be able to decrypt fragments of it for you. Uh, so let's, um... Oh, hello. Check it out. Unread, unread. So, mission report. Bandwidth is good. Mission report. Bandwidth is good. Finished tutorial scan. Initial calibration. Logged into Star Network as autonomous drone. Bandwidth is good. Connection is good. Network is good. Broker's notes. Remember that we need to work with the surveyors to increase your rank access. They need to think you are a high-functioning AI. And then these, like, little artifacts, right? right. Uh, signal data, archive remnant ZZ, or 22, maybe. Uh, com log remainder, 5578F678. Index 2, whenever. Drone index 2, whenever. Index brother, they say you have trouble on that new rock. Yes, interference of some kind. If we did not know better, we might say it was malicious and deliberate. But there is nothing here. Some unusual minerals, magnetic fields, no discernible pattern. It is all silent movies, drone. Fine, make jokes. But there is something here inhibiting our wider operations in the sector. More than noise. Intelligence. You have at least found a rich vein of excuses, then? Signing off. <laughs> okay. Uh, data snoopers like these, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. All right, cool. So there is some story, like little snippets of story, whether connected or sort of tangentially related to each other, that we can find, and that's definitely my cup of tea. So let's head to this bunker, then, shall we? In this direction. Unless there's something over here behind these rocks. Is there? Is there? Is there? Is there? Is there? Is there nothing? Okay. So we're in the QMass Basin. We're gonna go to the bunker. Let's go to the bunker. See what that's all about. We'll probably call it there. Cool. I really like this. I really like uh, these like explore the world and see what everything's about type of games. I'm sure there's gonna be you know combat and stuff because obviously like, like I said we do have guns, but. Just walking around, especially in like a sci-fi setting, I'm all about that. Nope, no data, fine. Buddy. Unmarked drone, ambient 09 neutral. Incoming transmission, there's an allied base up ahead. You can register your scan results and pick up new equipment at the terminal. Star Network Bunker 5 tube pattern dispute. Era. Okay. Yeah, I'm seeing a thing we can pick up there. Is there something over here? Maybe? Nope, not really. The sound when you switch frequencies, though, is horrifying. I think we can all agree on this. Nope, there's no information about the uh, boxes that we are collecting here. Let's see, anything else? Before we head to the bunker, we're sort of serpentining our way, or serpentining, I don't know, our way across. I'm hoping we can find maybe another signal to process, because I do like those little snippets of information. And I like that they sort of, I mean, they didn't come up with a super novel way of doing anything. They just sort of say, well, there it is, this little scrap. You know, it's just, it's a buffer, but the fact that everybody's an AI, I guess, gives it a little bit of a novel twist in a sense of, essentially, it's capturing communications between residents that it would have to capture because they're machines. <laughs> oh, no. 
UMass Basin waypoint reached. Good to know. Hey guys. Just uh just another robot. Out the Whoa! Auto turret deployment variant. Oh easy easy. Hey buddy, are you sure you want to go past that thing? It's gonna, you know. Knock you out a little. Maybe. Auto turret. Orbital deployment variant. Yeah. Is that us, though? Hey, man. Hey, hey guy. Nothing? Okay. That's fine. That's perfectly fine. Or you scan incomplete okay fine be that way dude be about incomplete scans no data available no data available okay so there maybe something over here that we can oh I'm seeing I'm seeing another data cache I don't even know what it's called like a thing that we can scan there we go two of them oh I'm all about this Added library, data fragment 21, so they aren't ZZ, they are actually numbers. Okay, we scan this, didn't scan that yet. Oh, I see. Color's a little bit different. Yeah, there we go, 57, so 21 and 57. Incoming transmission, excellent! These snooper fragments will help us piece together even more data on this planet's mysteries. Yeah, man, I'm all about these mysteries right now. No? No. Okay. Star Network Bunker 5 tube. No, 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 come on, what's in the box? Nothing? Okay. Um, so... Let's see, let's see. No data? Okie dokie. Uh, before I go inside this bunker, let's go ahead and read these two unread pieces. So, Data Fragment 21. Network Remnant number 2342GS. Hash rescued hash. What layers do we expect a system to reveal to us when we scrutinize it from the position of a lower magnitude of intelligence? What did the behavior of apes reveal to the mosquitoes landing on them? It is this disconnect between orders of magnitude that we find in the universe which will point us in the right direction. The classic model of functional intelligence, best evidenced in drone implementations and Starship AI, cannot always apply. Once we begin to see how footprints of sentience sit outside purely functional frameworks, we can begin to understand what has happened here. Hash, hash, hash. Related harvest chain. High tone tremor in signature footprinting. Pre Jetterex effigy mapping. Interesting. Okay. And snooped data. Uh, snooped datum 57. Snoop datum. Source surveyor private memo number ZZZZAZ121. Detached war fragment. It seems clear now that the decision to base military units on this planet has been a mistake. We are withdrawing all drones, automata, and AI network capabilities and mothballing all facilities. Bunkers will remain intact and can be brought online by standard star network overrides. We have encrypted the initial gating process to avoid this being knocked on by interlopers. It won't keep out experts, but it's better than just leaving it wide open. We realize some of our peers in the network will question this decision, but if they want proof, they should attempt operations of their own on this haunted ruin. We are signing off. Interesting. So there definitely is some darkness happening around here. And uh, hopefully we'll find out. Also, you guys are just beat up, huh? Look at this. Okay. Let's go see what this is all about. Access to terminal. Sure. Mission successful. Initial completion rank zero. Rewards a kobold. Sure. Why not? 
View map mission, access data library, customize loadout. This is me, huh? Rank zero, yeah, yeah. Unique drone, uh, AG9Q7U8. Customize my loadout. What do we got? A gnome. Basic disruptive driven assault rifle, standard iron sights. Equip this primary weapon. A gouge, scout class medium repeater railgun with standard scope. I got a shield. Uh, local ignition field causes a localized conflagration damaging nearby enemies. So this is a grenade, I guess. Equip this local area effect. And a hazard suit, base level off unit, offers no hazard protection. Okay. So what do we got? We can buy this. Click to buy for 200. Reactor drain. Meh. Meh. So it's not so much that they give it to me, it's that they unlock it. Well, that's boring. We can get other stuff, right? Chassis regen, nanobot repair pulse, men's nearby surveyors. Disrupt sensor on nearby robots for a short time. And countermeasures using local hostile to retreat. Um... Well, let's use conflagration for now. I mean, we haven't used any of this stuff, so it's fine. And back. I wonder that. I guess this is levels. Oh wow, we can level up in this game. Holy moly! We're back. And the pistol. I guess we can't swap out one way or the other. We do something here. Okie dokie. Well, this was interesting. I am looking forward to continuing on if you guys want. Uh, I am always up for this. I am, you know, you know me. I am intrigued by this game and I would like to learn more. And since there's this drip, drip, drip of lore you can pick up from these little uh, caches, I am all about it. Okay, but we are going to call it here. Uh, next time we come back, we're probably going to continue on to... The spawn beacon, I don't know what it is, but we'll find out. And there is this interference, this other scan thing that we can do. It looks like there are... Oh, we can have fights? Cool. We did this. Okay, I gotcha. So yeah, so we're just going to walk around. We're going to go over here next. And then we're going to go from here, here, and, you know, we'll figure out a way to, to probably go here and, and, and explore further. Okay, so next time, certainly, we're going to get uh, to this... Uh, spawn beacon and then to this bunker location I don't even know and we will go from there if you guys enjoyed this like comment subscribe tell a friend lets me know that I'm doing something right lets me know that you guys want to see more of this stuff if you have thoughts on the game you want to see more of it you don't want to see more of it you want to you know as I said in the other video you want to berate me for uh, the long hiatus quite rightfully uh, then by all means everything's welcome Leave a comment, and I will see you guys next time.